Show Network, your summertime home of chilling and big winning fun. Get ready to match the stars. Scoey Mitchell, Brett Summers, Charles Nelson Riley, Bonnie Franklin, Richard Dawson, and Patty Doyle as we play the star-studded Big Money Match Game 76. And now, here's the star of Match Game 76, Gene Raver! Hello, one and all. What? What do you want? Hi, uh, well, I'll tell you what, this lady, <laughs> listen, uh, what do you, what do would you, you turn do? on her microphone here and there? I've got to do something here. What are you going to do? I just want to show the studio audience something here. <laughs> <laughs> she sits like this all the time. She's been sitting like this every day, all day. <laughs> Who's your Maharishi? No, see, this isn't really a yoga position. To really do that, you have to do that. It's not oh. really yoga, it's a deformity. No, I love a joke, but I love game shows, too. It's called Move Your Furniture. <laughs> Are you all right? Uh, no. Don't walk before yeah. this is over. Heel! <laughs> Good. This little lady's a star of one day at a time. A day at a time. It's a day at a time. Oh, it you were right the first time. Oh, one day at a one time. One day at a time. Okay, Tuesday nights on CBS. 9.30, after no. mass. Okay. Right. Uh, did you have something? Everything all right? But then let's. No, uh, I yes, have Charles. Nothing. First of all, Brett has been sitting like that since match game seventy-three. <laughs> yes. And prove she hasn't. Right? Look, there it is. This, uh, sitting I the never same way. Seen, I'm never up there. I never noticed well, sure. that. Well, sure. Yes. Except with the veil. You Terrific, Charles. Glad you brought it up. Good let's opening. say hello to Bill Dotson and Janet Vreeland. Hello, Janet Vreeland. <laughs> Bill is our current champion. He's won a total of $6,300. And he is going to be challenged now by Janet Vreeland, whom we are meeting for the first time, and we'd like to find out about you, my dear. Well, I've been married 23 years to the same man, and I have two children, an 18-year-old and a 22-year-old. Okay, and where do you live? In this area? Van Nuys. Van, Van Nuys, California. Van Nuys, California. Mm -hmm. Good luck to you, Janet. We'll Thank start you. this game in a moment or so, but first we've got to start up a little business with you. Then come right back. Weekdays on Game Show Network. It's 25 words or less at 3. Followed by the $100,000 Pyramid at 4. <laughs> Chain Reaction at 5. And People Puzzler at 6. I believe in you. Your go-to game shows weekdays starting at 3. Only on Game Show Network. COVID-19 moves fast. And now you can too. By asking your healthcare provider if an oral treatment is right for you. Oral treatments can be taken at home and must be taken within five days from when symptoms first appear. If you have symptoms of COVID-19, even if they're mild, don't wait. Get tested quickly. If you test positive and are at high risk for severe disease, act fast. Ask if an oral treatment is right for you. COVID-19 moves fast, and now you can too. Attention, did you or a loved one live at or near Marine Base Camp Lejeune in North Carolina between 1953 and 1987? If so, listen closely for this important legal announcement. From 1953 to 1987, Marines and their family members at Camp Lejeune drank water that was contaminated with hazardous toxins. The toxins found in the water at Camp Lejeune may cause health issues, especially later in life. Types of health issues associated with water at Camp Lejeune are numerous. If you or a loved one lived near Camp Lejeune between 1953 and 1987, you may be entitled to substantial financial compensation without going to court. Even if you were turned down in the past, a new law can allow you to file a claim today. If you or a loved one spent time near Camp Lejeune, call the Negligence Network to find out if you're eligible for financial compensation. There's no fee unless we win your case. Call 1-800-300-0766. That's 1-800-300-0766. Here we go. Push a button, reveal our first round questions, and ask Janet, our challenger, if she wants A or B. I'll take B. B it is. Are you ready over here? Yeah. Yo. Flora said, I'm worried about staying at this hotel. 
The man who took my bags was wearing a blank. Got it. Who that bang? He can sing because he knows where to find the answer. Oh. <laughs> Charles. Oh, <laughs> 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 I thought I worried about saying at this hotel the man who took my badge was wearing a blank. Charles. Very good. See, you, you speak sharply enough to me. Just jokes him into bloody. All right, understand. we come over here to Jan Freeland. Flora said, I'm worried about staying at this hotel. The man who took my bags was wearing a blank. Gun. A gun. Mm -hmm. no. <laughs> I don't think so, Janet. Show her a good answer, Scoey. It's gonna be another one of those games, huh? Yeah. <laughs> another zip to zip. I said dress. A dress. That's one good possibility. Show us another one, Brett. This is, I think, not. He was wearing a little stocking over his head. A stocking over his head is another good one, the way bank robbers do, Charles. He was wearing a stocking. A stocking on his leg. Okay. <laughs> and Bunny. I said dress, too. A dress. Two dresses and two stockings, Richard. Well, this was a very nice hotel. Yes, I mean, it was a nice she, hotel. That's why she went there. And he was wearing just a simple evening gown. An evening gown. Okay. He looked very nice. Well, him. listen, he had big tips. So he could afford those expensive oh. evening gowns. He certainly could. Excuse me. The nice hotel, you Saved see, they've given... Saved by Jean, okay? <laughs> yes? Oh, hello. The man who took my yeah. bags was wearing a gun, according to Janet. That may be, but you couldn't see it underneath his very tasteful ball gown. <laughs> <laughs> now, you know, the answer that occurred to me, the man was wearing a mask. Did, did you reject that? That was my first answer. Would you? Yeah, you wouldn't give me a luggage. Ever, do you want, let, let's just stop an average MC in the yes. middle of a show. Right, right, ask me. Have you ever given your luggage to a man wearing a mask? <laughs> but, I mean, if you go into Have you own... ever? No, I haven't. I rest my case. Ask the next question. <laughs> Have you? Oh, Just a second now, Fox. You can ask me, ask me. The defense attorney has his right, too, right. to speak as a day in court. Have you ever given your luggage to someone wearing an evening gown? Time and time again. <laughs> so I just can't up. win with these Hollywood characters. <laughs> you ready, Bill? Right. You are? Yes. Okay. Yeah, that's a switch. Throw me. I ask you now. Have you seen the Lawrence Welk show lately? Uh -oh. Yes. Yeah. Lately. yeah. Well, yep. let me tell you about it. Lawrence opens every show by blanking in the bubble machine. <laughs> you like that one, don't you, Dawson? <laughs> Look at her. You like that one there. Ball down, indeed. Welk. Lawrence Welk. He opens every show by blanking in the bubble machine. Oh. Please. Okay. Fill this out and wait for Dr. Cleveland on that side of the hospital. All right. No, I'm sorry. I'm not here for x-rays. Well, then go over there. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Hello, Bill. Have you been thinking about this? Yes, I have. Well, I'll give it to you one more time. You may want a little more thinking time. Have you seen the Lawrence Welk show lately, Bill? No, I haven't. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll tell you, Bill. He opens every show by blanking in the bubble machine. Tinkling. <laughs> I know. Now stick around, Scott. Get back up there. Get back up there. I'm sorry. You signed a contract to do all these shows. Oh. You got to stay for the whole week. Get up there now. There's nothing wrong with that. Tell, no, there's nothing. tell them what you did, huh? Yes. What did you do? <laughs> Don't tell them what you said, but tell them what you did, huh? Well, I mentioned that. Yes. And, and you... I just dismissed it. I really did because... You said nobody would say that. Nobody would say that, yes. you know? But you forgot who you were dealing yeah, with. Yes, sir. You keep switching on us, man. That's right. <laughs> I said bathing. Bathing. That's very good. Yes. Excellent. Brett? Do you, gonna... you think we're going to have a zip-to-zip zip again? Could be. Just... I say 
say it, uh, hopefully, uh, in his accent, I thought he might catch it from over here. I said bathing naked. Bathing naked in right. the bubble machine. Charles, what did you say? A boring swimming comes to Swimming me. in the bubble machine. Yeah. Bill Dotson said Lawrence opens every show by tinkling in the bubble machine. What do you say, Bonnie? Blowing. Blowing. That was my answer, too. It Blowing was. bubbles to make bubbles come out you of the machine. Well, I think that's a wonderful, a wonderful. <laughs> wonderful, a wonderful. <laughs> yeah, every, every Saturday night, you see me a tinkling in the bubble machine. Showstop. Showstop. Time to get down, girl. And now the lovely Lennon <laughs> sisters. I said you were a weirdo a little earlier, and now you've got two weirdos. <laughs> okay, Batty. Yes? Lawrence opens every show by by tinkling in the bubble machine, according to Bill Dotson. Well, where I was brought up, we weren't allowed to say tinkling. Oh, you were good. No. Splendid. Whizzing. Whizzing. <laughs> OK, that's two for you. So we finally got a score showing there. That's two to nothing in favor of Bill. And we'll come to round two in a moment or so, but right now this. I love to restore old houses. John Knight has. Right stuff. Right stuff. That brings me Whoa! so much joy. Farmhouse Fixer, only on HGTV. Your shipping manager left to find themselves, leaving you lost. You need to hire. I need Indeed. Indeed you do. Indeed Instant Match instantly delivers quality candidates matching your job description. Visit indeed.com slash hire. With Choice Hotels, there's always a reason to book it. Hey, bud. How about we go on a little trip? Can I come? Whatever your reason, save up to 20% when you book over 7,100 locations at choicehotels.com. Hey, Caleb, what's going on? Homework. I'm supposed to learn how to cook a souffle. Ooh, French. Impressive. Oui, vous devriez l'apprendre. Ça vous fait paraître plus intelligent. I have no clue what you're saying. Yeah, I said that you should learn French because it makes you sound smart. <laughs> I got you. You know what else is smart, Alec? Donating to Shriners Hospitals for Children. I thought you'd say that. And you know what? You're right. Just think what it would be like if people didn't support Shriners Hospitals for Children every month. I don't even want to think about it. I know so many kids whose lives are completely different because of the specialized care Shriners Hospitals for Children provides. Yeah, like Sebastian, who can stand now? Yeah, and the best part is it's so easy to become a monthly supporter. All you need to do is call the number on your screen or go to loveshriners.org. Your support will make sure our amazing doctors and nurses keep helping kids like us who need them now and in the future. Hey, Allie, do you think I could try this part? Go for it, buddy. When you call right now and give $19 a month, only 63 cents a day, We'll send you your very own Love at the Rescue blanket as a reminder of all the kids you're helping every day. Your monthly support makes a huge difference for kids like us. So please, call now or go to loveshriners.org to give. On behalf of all the kids you're helping, Alec and I just want to say thank you. You got that right. Thank you so much. Please call the number on your screen or go to loveshriners.org with your monthly support right away. Your support shows you care too. Round two coming up. Janet, it's up to you. You can have A or B. I'll try B again. B again? Everybody plays? Since uh, she didn't match anybody in the first round with B. Did you? Uh, hey, have you heard about this new uh, Gidget movie? 
Uh -uh. Let me tell you about it. In this one, Gidget becomes a hippie. It's called Gidget Goes to Blank. <laughs> it's, uh, Gidget becomes a hippie. The movie is called Gidget Goes to Blank. Well, I know. Several, uh, yes. Choices. Couple of real good ones yeah. here. Gidget, uh, what kind of movie? A uh, hippie. Yes. In this one, Gidget becomes a hippie, and the movie is called Gidget Goes to Blank. These offices are closed, so you'll oh, have to sorry. come back Monday morning. Oh, okay. All right. Goodbye. I'm going, sir. Sign on the window said you're open till three o'clock. Okay. <laughs> Here we go with Janet Vreeland. Hear about the new Gidget movie, Janet? Mm. Let me tell you about it. <laughs> In this one, Gidget becomes a hippie, and the movie is called Gidget Goes to Blank. The only thing I can think of is San Francisco. Gidget Goes to San Francisco. <laughs> hey, let's hold it down. <laughs> You're not making her feel any better now. OK. Gidget Goes to Blank. Scoy, what do you say? Hey, Ashbury. Hey, Ashbury. Okay, Janet. Listen, right. he gets them seldom enough. Please don't blank them up when he does. Right. How I do said, I didn't say that strangely enough. I said she went to Hades. <laughs> you know where that is, don't yes, you? Yes, I know where Jim? that is, yes. Charles, what did you say? What? What's that say? Give the to She understands now. Did you understand, Bonnie? Uh -huh, I understood. What'd you put? Hate Ashbury. Hate Ashbury. Wow, that's amazing. Okay, that's two for Janet. Richard? Scoey and uh, Bonnie Mitch. Uh, that's right. Oh. Good for you, Janet. The lunatics have taken over the asylum. Right. <laughs> I said Gidget went to pop. Gidget goes to pop. There it is. That's the answer. The definitive answer. A little play on words there. What have you got? Uh, Gidget goes to pot, a.k.a. grass. A.k.a. grass. Okay. So now in the middle of round two, it's two to two. And all you have to do one more time is match one celebrity. <clears throat> excuse me, and you've won another game. <clears throat> Susie said, my blind date had horrible manners. He not only talked with his mouth full, he blanked with his mouth full. <laughs> Terrible manners. Two people do not write, you and you do not write. The rest do. I, 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 he not only talked with his mouth full, he blanked with his mouth full. I uh, hate. I can't. Well, this is a good one. I know, but I don't like the alternatives in the answers. Well, there's one that should come to your mind immediately. Yes, of course there is. My blind date had horrible manners. He not only talked with his mouth full, he blanked with his mouth full. Okay. <laughs> 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 Anytime you're ready, Charles, we'll keep waiting. Bill Dotson. Susie said, my blind date had horrible manners. He not only talked with his mouth full, he blanked with his mouth full. Kissed. Kissed is very good. All right, Joe, you're getting the hang of it. It's about time. Yeah. <laughs> Bill is finally getting the hang of it. He gave a very good answer there, Scoey. Maybe I should change places with him, because <laughs> I got lost again. You get lost again? I said he made love with his mouth full. Made love with his mouth full. That's close. You were both on the same track. Not, we can't match that, however. Brett? That's a goo goo nya nya a question because yes. I don't like the thought of somebody kissing somebody with their mouth full because yeah. it's yucky. But that's the answer, isn't it? It is? Yeah. That's why I said it. Kid. Oh, that wins the game. What the rest of you have, Charles? Yeah, all right, okay. Okay, Bill, here you are again. Hang around there. Janet, it was a short, pleasant meeting for us. Thank you. Nice to have met Janet here. Freeland. We've got gifts for you. Thanks thank for being you. with us here on Match Game 76. Bye, and now we thank you for paying attention to the messages that pay the rent. This is a paid legal advertisement. Attention, anyone who spent time at Camp Lejeune before 1988. This is an important legal announcement. For decades, Marines and their family members used water that was contaminated with hazardous toxins. These toxins may cause cancer and other diseases. You may now be entitled to significant compensation from the federal government. A special hotline has been established. Call now for a free case evaluation. Just call 800-455-0830.
If you or a family member lived or worked at Camp Lejeune, you consumed toxic water known to cause cancer and other serious health issues, including birth defects, leukemia, Parkinson's disease, miscarriage, and even death. Even if you've been turned down in the past, new legislation may allow you to file a claim now. This will not affect your eligibility for VA disability benefits. Call now to see if you or your loved ones qualify for significant compensation. Just call 800-455-0830 now. That's 800-455-0830. Do you have a life insurance policy you no longer need? Now you can sell your policy, even a term policy, for an immediate cash payment. Call Coventry Direct to learn more. We thought we had planned carefully for our retirement. But we quickly realized we needed a way to supplement our income. Our friends sold their policy to help pay their medical bills. And that got me thinking. Maybe selling our policy could help with our retirement. I was skeptical. So I did some research and called Coventry Direct. They explained life insurance is a valuable asset that can be sold. We learned we could sell all of our policy or keep part of it with no future payments. Who knew? We sold our policy. Now we can relax and enjoy our retirement as we had planned. If you have $100,000 or more of life insurance, you may qualify to sell your policy. Don't cancel or let your policy lapse without finding out what it's worth. Visit CoventryDirect.com to find out if your policy qualifies or call 1-800-509-8500. Coventry Direct, redefining insurance. Okay. It's your fun summer ride to Trivia Town. Cash Cab, weekend starting at 1 p.m., only on Game Show Network. Here we are again with Bill Dotson, fourth time up here. Now, right now he has $6,400. He's going to try for over $5,000 again. You ready? I'm ready. All right, Bill, we pulled a recent studio audience, and we got their best response to this. House of Blank. Remember, the answer they gave most often is worth $500 to you if you match it. $250 $250 if you match the second most frequently given answer, and $100 for the bottom one there. Now, whom do you call on over here, Bill? Richard. House of Flowers. House of Flowers. Okay. Huh. Did you earn him $6,400 or did I? I start right. listening to you, I'll be driving a bus Thursday. That's right. House Charles. of Flowers. Charles, have you got one? Yes, and if they're watching, I wear a 42 long, a medium size, and you can send everything directly here. House of Suede. <laughs> That's a local yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a local question. Okay. All right, the House of Bernada Alba. Oh, no. <laughs> house of Suede is your answer. That's Brian. <laughs> Brian. I have two more left. No, thank you, but it's very nice of you. I say House of... Oh, I'm so... I want to... You want you to get it, Bill. How about the House of Ill Repute? <laughs> So those are the three, House of Ill Repute, House of Suede, and House of Flowers. You want one of those? Yes, House of Ill Repute. Ah, let's hope it's up there. What are they going to think about you down in North Carolina? Is that where you're from? That's it. What are they going to say about that when you say House of Ill Repute? They already know. Oh, they know. Okay. I don't know why someone didn't pick the one I had. What was that? House of Rothschild. House of Rothschild that's is good. good. That's, that's a good one. Yeah. Okay. Right. That's the one that's in the five hundred dollars. Well, the House of Ill Repute is the one we are looking for, oh, folks. There. Let's find out if it's up there, and if so, where? May we see the one hundred dollar response? House of Seven Gables is oh, the first one. A terrible start. I think the seven. It's a terrible start. Is the House of Ill Repute under the two hundred and fifty dollar response? Oh, oh. I don't that's that close. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, their spelling oh, is rotten, but what the heck? There, no. Okay, yes, I know. <laughs> you finally got it, Madam May. Okay, last chance. It's not be Boy, this is <laughs> not one answer. $500 house of ill repute. Are you under there? Let's see it. Yeah. Okay, Bill, you've enriched yourself now by an additional $500. You have a total of $6,900 at this moment. You're going to play now for 10 times that amount or $5,000. Remember to collect, you have to match one exactly, and it's time to choose one. Brett. Oh! <laughs> oh, okay. 
Okay. You ready, Brett? Yeah, I guess. All right, so. I'll get the question. It's worth five thousand. Big ones. What's in there? Are you concentrating? Trying to. Get your ESP going. Get those thought waves going between the two of you. Remember, thought waves are electricity. Think hard. Blank. Wave. W A V E. I just begin to perspire when this happens. Okay, Bill, she's ready. Now you think real hard and give us an answer which you think will match hers. Blank wave. Permanent wave. Permanent wave. What's wrong with that? That's not a bad said? answer. What would they have said? What would you have said? What? Heat wave. Okay, cut. Title. Heat wave and shock wave are what they're saying. Brett, he says permanent wave will match you for $5,000. What do I, you say? I feel terrible. I thought permanent, but I thought he's a man. So I put title. Title wave. I'm sorry. Don't. Dawson's holding up the card. It says nya, nya, nya. Permanent have? wave there. Okay. okay. Permanent. permanent wave. I would have said something about ocean wave or something. That was the first thought that I have. Yeah. <laughs> I would have lost too. Well, Bill, you're up to 6,900 the hard way. <laughs> Four games. And you're going to meet another player right now, so let's welcome Linda Gilliam. Hello, honey. Hello. Climb aboard the merry-go-round, Bill. You know Linda. How are you? Well, Linda, we welcome you. Thank you very much. And ask you to tell us about yourself. Well, I'm a modeling instructor and a freelance model, and I just moved to L.A. about two years ago, and I love it. <laughs> Good for you. You're happy here. Yes. Okay. May I just show the audience something most unusual. I have never oh seen anything God. like this ever. Isn't that... Isn't that something? Hmm. What do you call that? Nails. Oh. Well, wouldn't she be fun on a date? <laughs> Unless you give her $7,000, she's going to draw those nails across the blackboard. <laughs> All right. Now, the two of you are all set. Before we do anything, we've got to do a little business with America, and this is the nature of the business. Get down. With your fun and funky game show family. Well, it won't be too long now. <laughs> Match Game. Another episode next. Only on Game Show Network. Are you ready for a fresh new bath or shower? Well, now is the best time with 50% off installation and no interest and no payments for one year. Hi, I'm Christina, and it's time to flip your old worn out bath or shower with Jacuzzi Bath Remodel today. Everyone knows the Jacuzzi brand. They're the most trusted name in water for over 60 years. But did you know they can install a gorgeous bath or shower that feels incredible in as little as one day? It's no stress and no mess with a lifetime warranty. Now let's talk beauty. You deserve to start and end your day in a beautiful space that feels great and is custom designed just for you. So call or go online now to see the Christina preferred designs like Canyon, Farm, and Urban. Now that's the total bathroom beauty that I love at a price you can afford. And how about safety? Like an ultra low profile, easy entry shower complete with grab bars and a custom design seat. You deserve safety and peace of mind without sacrificing style. Because with all the worries in daily life, taking a shower shouldn't be one of them. Every time I stepped over my old tub, I worried I might fall. I don't have those fears anymore. Jacuzzi bath remodel gave me a gorgeous shower that's safe too. I've been trying to get him to remodel that bath for years. I called and they didn't just one day. And at a price we could afford. With one call to Jacuzzi Bath Remodel, you can effortlessly transform that old, ugly eyesore into the stunning bath or shower of your dreams that you'll love for years to come. Call or go online to jacuzzibathremodel.com now to get up to 50% off installation. Plus, ask how you may qualify for no interest and no payments for 12 months. And when you call right now, we'll give you an additional safety upgrade free. Go to jacuzzibathremodel.com or call 800-207-9371. That's 800-207-9371. Call now. Hey, those nails on that contestant, that little girl, they were real. They were her own nails. I can't believe it. Tune in next time and find out. Gene Mabern here, Match Game 76. Goodbye. Is it... 
summer. You bet it is. It's the season that brings the heat a fast and fun word chains. Swimming pool, pool table. That's it. With answers you can almost. Alternative rock? Feel. Is that how you dance to alternative rock? Yeah. yeah. That's it. So this summer, make a date with the chains. Are you ready? On Chain Reaction, weeknights starting at 5, only on Game Show Network.